Millions are hitting the roads and taken to the skies as they return home from their Thanksgiving festivities. Airports warn passengers to expect delays after airlines canceled thousands of flights across the nation yesterday. But so far, that hasn't been the case. Most of the cancellations into or out of the United States, nearly 90%, are foreign airlines because of issues they had in their other countries there. Eyewitness News reporter Lucy Yang joins us from LaGuardia Airport where arrival and departure delays are under an hour. Lucy. Well, that's right, Joe. This is supposed to be one of the worst travel days as folks return home from their Thanksgiving gatherings. But perhaps the turkey was amazing this year because passengers we spoke with this afternoon were all smiles. There were some tears at Terminal A at LaGuardia tonight, but mostly smiles. Travelers here still glowing from their Thanksgiving break. It was amazing. For Stephanie Almeida, it was pure bliss. No one had to cook or clean. You went to the Bahamas for Thanksgiving? I did. Family trip, 48 of us on the boat. Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Yeah, it was the best family trip we've had, so... Great to escape the winter. By the way, it turns out Stephanie is Miss Multiverse and flying home tonight proved as smooth as a Caribbean beach. Estenisla Lopez also returning from a cruise with nothing but happy memories. We're coming from Fort Lauderdale. Um, it was a little crowded over there, but it was very smooth. Over at Newark Airport, the terminals were decked out for the holidays, but no serious delays to report. For this college student, getting back to school in Vermont will take just about every form of transportation, but Cody is not complaining. So you had to do a train, a plane, and a car? Yep. Just to get home from Thanksgiving? Yes. Yeah. Was that yeah. worth it? Uh, yeah, it's worth it. Uh, Miami was great, so it's <laughs> nice to get some warm weather. Now, Cody says another silver lining in having to land in New York City is that she'll get a great meal in K-Town tonight before continuing the rest of her trip up to Vermont. We want to know why we never got the memo for a family cruise. As for the roads, you can expect those to get con increasingly congested as we edge into the night.